Welcome to the third in our series of short videos about epilogue from CCL Forensics. Alex Caithness again, this time with a brief demonstration of how epilogue can recover deleted SMS data. The data we'll be using was acquired from an Android phone. If you've not already downloaded your free trial version of Epilogue, you can do so at our website. The time-limited version allows you to see at first hand how Epilogue can recover deleted data from SQLite databases. So, on to the example. Over the next few minutes we'll look at the raw flash image recovered from an HTC Wildfire, an Android handset. The data was recovered using the handset's JTAG interface, so we've got a very raw read of the flash, warts and all, and it's likely to be pretty fragmented but it may also contain a significant amount of deleted data. Looking at the raw data in a hex editor, you could potentially carry out a search for data that looks like phone number strings, find which are linked to messages, and carve out the data by hand. However, this is very labour intensive, and you could potentially lose the meaning of other data associated with the record. Alternatively, let's look at how the data could be recovered using Epilogue. For this example, we're going to use the raw data disk image search. First of all, you need to point epilogue at the data you want to search in. In this case, it's our raw JTAG image. In order to perform the search, epilogue needs to know some key facts about the database's structure. So we provide an example database. In this case, it's an empty Android SMS database. Finally, we provide the signature of the SMS table. You can download this signature file along with many others from our website. And if you have any suggestions for other signatures, please do get in touch. All that's left to do is click Process and Epilog will perform the search. On this image this will take about a minute and a half, so let's skip straight to the results. Here you can see that Epilog has recovered a number of SMS messages from this raw JTAG image, all with the correct record structure, far removed from carving the data by hand in the hex editor. Remember, Epilog is available as a free trial download from our website. Additionally, training can also be provided to help you get the most out of Epilog. In our next video, we'll focus on Epilogue's insert statement export, and, using a Safari web cache as an example, we'll see how you can rebuild the recovered records back into the database, allowing you the opportunity to see the data in context, and parse it using other tools and scripts. Thanks again for watching, and as ever, please feel free to contact us with any queries.